At the end of August, Russian authorities have launched what they call an alternative to Wikipedia. The website is called Runiversalis, and the motto is an encyclopedia of common sense. And when you take a closer look at the website, well, it looks very similar to Wikipedia. And the Runiversalis authors even claim that their editors used to work for Wikipedia. However, there are very stark differences. For example, you have this section called the Special Military Operation. Russia doesn't call what's happening in Ukraine a war or an invasion, and it's even criminalize the use of both of these words, instead framing it as the special military operation. And in the article uh, on Runiversalis about the conflict, it repeats the Kremlin propaganda narrative that the goal was to demilitarize and denazify Ukraine. And the encyclopedia's statement on Telegram also mentions that the authors will only promote traditional values when it comes to subjects like gender or sexuality, for example. And we spoke to Eto Buziashvili, a researcher that has studied Runiversalis, and she said that the website's goal is to spread the Kremlin's propaganda. When one starts to read uh, the Runiversalis, is um... Basically, you momentarily notice that it is a platform for Kremlin narratives of disinformation and propaganda. A very interesting point is that when you go down to the references, uh, you will find that the vast majority of the sources are Kremlin official platforms like Ministry of Defense or uh, Ministry of Foreign Affairs or the Kremlin controlled media. And Runiversalis was only up for two days until it became a target of a cyber attack taking down the website. And according to their Telegram page, Runiversalis was restored on the 12th of September before again being a target of yet another cyber attack. Since Russia's invasion of Ukraine, the Kremlin has doubled down on censorship. And Wikipedia is among these Western websites that Russia has fined and threatened to silence. And although Wikipedia hasn't been blocked in Russia, since July, authorities are obligating search engines to inform users that Wikipedia is violating the country's legislation.